Ahoy mateys! It's Ben with Playwell. We're actually going to get out of the shed today and go on a little adventure, but I wanted to first explain how it all started. I built this little model of a sailboat a while back, and it's a pretty neat model. It's got two main functions. It has a little rudder that can be powered with this wheel here, and as you know the rudder would steer the boat. And then it has these two cranks here which can move the sail back and forth and that would allow the boat to catch wind at different angles which would propel it forward. Now it's a neat model and it shows some of the functions of a, of a real sailboat but it actually is not meant for the water. So what I thought I would do is design my own model here inspired by this boat that actually might work on the water. So this boat is all Lego except for this sail here which is from my daughter's Moana toy and basically the way this thing works is it has two main functions just like this boat and it's all powered by remote control so I can hopefully power it while I'm on the side and the boat is in the water. The two main functions are a sail moving back and forth with one with one of these controls and that'll allow me again to catch the wind at different angles and then the other one will steer back and forth by powering this rudder and when I let go that rudder should pop back to the center so I can go straight. So before we set sail I'm just going to do a little bit of building and encase these electric components to keep them as dry as possible when we hit the water. So let's see if this works. So here's the first touchdown to water and yes it actually floats. So you can see not too much wind, but when we swing around the sail on this side, it catches a little gust and propels the boat forward. The rudder wasn't too effective. It worked okay, but maybe it needed to be bigger, or maybe we just needed more wind to get going faster. But it did the job, basically. You can see, though, that by changing the position of that sail, it really maneuvered that boat and got it going depending on which way the sail was facing and which way the wind was blowing. So for a first try at a model like this, I don't think it went too badly. I'm excited to maybe revisit this and try to make some improvements and get back out on the water, maybe on a windier day, and see what happens. Thanks for watching. Remember to play well and see you next time.